Well, perhaps your barbecue got rained out for a little while this afternoon, but the fireworks should be fine. Even if those were natural here earlier this afternoon, the man made ones later tonight should get off without a hitch. 13 weather ball is green. No change to the hot and humid weather pattern foreseen. We'll take it down several notches though by Saturday and especially on Sunday. This view brought to you by good folks at Countryside Greenhouse of Allendale. Forecast 89 made 90 today. Two days in a row with your three degree guarantee. We may get close to 90 here again during the day tomorrow. So any uh, thunderstorms or showers should be departing and dissipating over the next couple of hours, and especially after the sun goes down. It's going to be a muggy night. Once again, you got to have that air conditioner on or your fans. And then again, an isolated afternoon pop up inland thunderstorm on Friday. No worries at the beaches. Another hot and humid day, but sunnier, drier and less humid weather gradually on Saturday, and it should feel just fine uh, during the day on a Sunday. Well, we're still having problems with our Grand Haven drawbridge cam. It was a fabulous sight. A lot of folks going up and down the, the channel there, but it was a beautiful day to be out on the lake. Virtually flat ways despite the high water levels. Uh, uh, folks managed to get out on the piers and channel walls, but a lot of sunshine right now. All of the inland showers and thunderstorms have been popped up, popping up on what we call that lake breeze as it moves on in. Pretty good thunderstorm down toward Kalamazoo, putting down a lot of rain. A pretty good thunderstorm over the southeastern portion of Kent County, and they're pushing across Montcalm and Ionia counties right now. Just heavy downpours, occasional lightning strikes. Uh, these are ordinary showers and thunderstorms. They'll be anything but ordinary back to the west tonight. Uh, severe thunderstorm and tornado watches in the foothills of the Rockies out into the high plains. That's all going to stay away from us, but we're going to stay on the south side of this wavy stationary front, which means another hot and humid day on Friday. A little bit less humidity on Saturday. Other than that, other than an ordinary thunderstorm tomorrow tonight, most of the heavier storms will be back to our west. There's a, a moderate risk over here in Nebraska and portions of Wyoming and tomorrow uh, just a marginal risk lowest on the scale across much of the Midwest. Just some ordinary pop up thunderstorms with some heavy downpours. That's what we got going on. This is our model uh, showing that all of these over the next couple of hours are going to be falling apart by between now and 11 o'clock. Maybe just some residual cloud cover and then right around one or two o'clock there might might be a pop up shower around Muskegon on up through Fremont, but as we wake up in the morning tomorrow, sunshine to start your Friday should be another great day. Uh, but in the afternoon, we're watching an area of storms that may pop up along the I-94 corridor and from Big Rapids northward. I think those will be the only areas that see rain again during the day tomorrow and then no chance of rain coming up on Saturday and Sunday. So tomorrow, mostly sunny skies at the lakeshore, pretty much what we saw today. Mid 80s to maybe even near 90 there in Holland up north. You can expect mid and upper 80s, 88 the warm spot in Greenville. Few more clouds here and from Grand Rapids southward again, there'll be a pop up shower or thunderstorm. I'm thinking from about Benton Harbor, maybe South Haven to Hastings to Lansing. I think that's where the northern extent will be. We may hit 90 again here in GR 13 on your side forecast. <coughs> Mid 80s, still humid on Saturday, but a lot less humidity. A very comfortable Sunday and Monday with low 80s, lots of sunshine. A few more clouds Tuesday and Wednesday as it gets a little bit more humid. Uh, toward the end of next week, uh, may cool off to as warm as 77 on a Friday, and then back into the 80s both Saturday and Sunday. Uh, again, no real chilly air coming in our direction, uh, just a little bit less humidity, and that's you know, the way we like it. You know what, George? Everybody was complaining when it's too cold. Now we're complaining because it's too hot, so I don't know that you'll ever have a happy medium. Uh, you can never make everybody happy. Nope, sure can't.